Welcome to Weld.com. Uh, recently I had a cameraman whining, I, I'm, I'm sorry, uh, recently I had a customer concerned with uh, doing a horizontal route. We mocked up and we did one on plate, same thing goes over to pipe. I have four inch schedule 40 and I want to do kind of the same thing here. Basically same procedure, same manipulation, everything. This is just round. Uh, I did a little bit over here just to kind of test settings and let the camera guy get comfortable with what he thought he was going to shoot. And we'll try to get, uh, you know, a really cool shot would be right here on the inside. We're going to get inside and outside. So uh, I'm running 332nd electrode, gas lens number seven cup. I'm going to do an eighth inch wire. I like using eighth inch wires. Uh, I like using 532s also. ER70S6, pure argon, about 20 cubic feet per hour. Uh, I'm running off of Everlast uh, Power TIG 200 DV. I have it set at 150, 160 amps. I'm, I'm not going to use it all. I'm going to feather this in with a foot pedal, see how it goes. I have, uh, oh, I've got a loose. I'm going to call that a 532nd opening, uh, 1 16th land small land on there so again I like to feed these just like we did on the on the plate I'm gonna reach around here and I'm gonna I'm gonna walk this in kind of feeding the wire from the I'm gonna rest it on this tack kind of feed it in there I like to kind of look through the inside of the pipe I like to catch just the outside and the inside there's times you get in positions where you can see the outside only but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to get out of your way if I can because I want you to see as much of this as possible. Again, this is the exact same thing as the plate run that we did and, uh, you know, same manipulation of filler wire slightly on the inside, back. I'd like to leave it up just a little bit on the back side. So let me go find some uh, safety glasses, sleeves, find a hood to wear here and we'll, we'll throw down here in just a second. Here we go. I'm going to let the cameraman get repositioned and he's going to shoot from the inside now. Okay, the, the recap here. <clears throat> um, we had set this up four inch schedule 40. Uh, viewer customer uh, was concerned about running roots. Um, I, it may have had a comment. Yeah, I, I remember it now. He was blown out the top side. I think he was running too hot. Um, I didn't have the, any help over here in the camera. I'm thinking I was running about 90 amps, maybe. Again, I had a 1 16th root face, so that's kind of mild and I had the eighth inch wire on the back side. Ran a little bit over here for a test, took off and ran this around here and tried to you know, get the, the camera angle reset. 
and I left a little viewing window over here and we looked at it, tried to get some B-roll video still shots on the inside. I think what I want to do is go over here and just saw cut this real close and we'll get, uh, we'll get some actual close up of the root itself. So again, I hope that helps. By the way, uh, I'm up here rolling this around. I mean, that's how little pressure I had on this. I'm just resting the cup in here. I'm not one to push on anything and try to try to cram the cup in there. So if this was loose up here and I'm moving it around, you know, you can do these with uh, you can practice some dry rig, lift start, uh, no amperage control without the foot pedal. You know, obviously we're we're running off of this one here with the foot pedal just to show you. So I hope this helps. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the videos. I'm going to go saw cut this and we'll get some other still shots and some video of it. Thanks for watching. Uh, which way you want to go? Doesn't matter to me. Think you missed a spot. There's a hole. Maka, 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 maka. Good Lord.